What's up, YouTube? Ethanol King88 here. Coming to you today, I want to talk to you guys about water in your final, like when you're evaporating your EHO. I noticed when using dry ice, um, there will be a lot of water left over. Uh, after all the alcohol is done evaporating, it'll start to look like this, and then it'll start to get a little bit more cloudy. You know, and it'll, it'll start to lose that alcohol smell. So I've found several ways to combat this, and I want to talk to you guys a little bit about that right now. I'm going to try and do a little short video on this right now for you. Um, so, all these solutions, all these had a little bit of water in them. And um, I read a couple things. Well, I read one thing that people are doing is they're adding a little more alcohol or Everclear to the to the mix and what that does is first of all it'll clear the solution up back to its golden color and uh, also what it does is it gives the water time to evaporate as the alcohol is evaporating now uh, honestly I do that a little bit I do a little bit of both uh, what I'll do is I'll, I'll add some water or I mean that water, forgive me. <laughs> I'll add some um, 190 or 200 proof ethanol. And I'll do that for a little bit. And then what I'll do is I'll start to make a fresh dish with parchment. And I will pour off. And I'll give you an example. This brownish ethanol slash water oil solution here was just in this one right here. And as you can see... I poured it off into here and it get you know it's better to pour start pouring it off into another dish. All the all the oil sinks to the bottom fairly rapidly and every twenty minutes to half an hour you can switch switch it to a new dish and you'll have something that looks like this no water and I know no one posts about the water that we deal with just because we don't want to hear the negative comments about you know whatever the haters or you know all the pro butane heads out there but um you know there's nothing wrong with good closed loop butane if it's done correctly but you know there's nothing wrong with EHO if you're doing it right um, so yeah, this stuff all has to purge. I got the big boy, 4 CFM, dual stage. Got some gold in there now. So yeah, um, if you guys are having a problem with water, um, I wish I had some, let me see if I have some alcohol left to, uh, forgive the camera angle for a second. I don't think I have any left in there. Nope. Fresh out, because I just did my last run. I just want to smell it. It's like 70%. I know. It's I'm, gonna, I'm an example. That's all. So I, I found a little bit of alcohol. I'll show you guys what I mean. And you add a little bit in, back into the solution. Stir it around a little bit. Everything goes back to the way it once was. Now I know this prolongs, you know, whatever, but if you've ever had to deal with water evaporating on your stuff, it takes forever, and if you don't want to add heat, well, that's a, and that's another thing I wanted to talk to you guys about. Um, as you can see, I don't use heat to evaporate. Um, when, see how I cleared right up? Now that gives the water time to evaporate while the alcohol is evaporating. Um, 
so I don't use heat to evaporate and I evaporate faster than someone that does use heat and the trick with that is fans clean a clean fan turn your fan on and what you're looking for is you want movement you want you want it to disturb this here yeah you want ripples in this the more it's disturbing this the faster your evaporation will happen something about um, I'm not totally up with the science of it but something about moving this air gives the ethanol solution more time to get let it evaporate faster by moving this air out of the way and using no heat um, all these were on last night I had about how many milliliters do you think we evaporated in about 24 hours Like All right, yeah, we evaporated 3,000 uh, milliliters, or not milliliters, no. yeah, yeah 3,000, I'm sorry, 3,000 milliliters, we evaporated in a little under 24 hours, and I'm still working, you know, with, with the exception of this little bit right here, I'm still working on it. So, yeah, uh, I stopped using the heat a while ago when I found out that um, just using fans to displace the air helps helps this shit evaporate 10 times faster than with heat. I don't know why adding heat slows it down, but it does. Um, so yeah, guys. Uh, check me out on Instagram, ethanolking88. If you have any questions, you can kick me, ethanolking88. You can Snapchat me there, too. Uh, you know, I try to answer the comments on YouTube as you know, best as possible. I know you guys are thinking that by adding more alcohol to this, it, it doesn't make sense, but try it, and you'll see exactly what I'm talking about. Yeah, so what I'll, what I'll do is I'll add a little bit of alcohol. Since I added alcohol to this, I'll let it sit, and when I come back and it starts to cloud up, I'll pour it off into another dish just like this. And as a matter of fact, I'll come back and show you guys when I do that.